PSI scientists have converged in the lab to determine the composition of dust. But this isn't just any dust. It's a simulated sample of Mercury's surface. Let me explain. When the messenger mission to Mercury arrived at the planet over 10 years ago, one of its main goals was to understand the surface composition. The onboard instruments were able to tease out the elemental composition, but they couldn't quite figure out how those fit together to create minerals. So this is now one of the goals of the Bepi Colombo mission set to arrive at Mercury in November, 2026. To practice and prepare for interpreting the data returned, scientists all around the world are participating in the Mercury Y project. This includes two scientists from PSI. The group that constructed the simulated sample ensured that it displayed the same properties as Mercury's surface based on Bepi Colombo data, but they didn't reveal its mineral properties. That's up for the scientists to figure out. Scientists think the messenger wasn't able to determine the mineral composition of the surface because of a phenomenon known as space weathering. A surface can be weathered from radiation by the sun, micrometeorite impacts, or even thermal heating and cooling. PSI scientists will be taking measurements that span from the ultraviolet to the mid-infrared, and also conducting X-ray diffraction and X-ray fluorescence. All of these measurements are going to be compared to those taken by the instruments on board Bepi Colombo.